you're looking at a KTM and you've heard somebody say, oh, it's a subscription, it, a rent, you got to oh, they'll shut it off. No, they can't shut it off. This is funny because I'm talking about KTM stuff on my Tenere. I'm tired of it. This, this is a dead horse. It's been beaten already and I'm going to beat it again. I love beating dead things. <laughs> This KTM subscription service thing is really, it really bugs me, especially after I saw this comment on one of my videos or on my last video. It's just ignorance. Um, that, that's all it is, just ignorance. And I don't mean that in with any animus. I, I mean it in the definition of the word. It's, it's ignorant for people to still say that KTM is a subscription service. It's not. But the fact is that yes, they put all of this stuff, the quick shifter, anyways, the electronics package, it comes on there. You don't have to buy the whole electronics package. You can pick and choose of what you want or what you think you might use. Like on my bike, the only thing that I have got activated is the rally mode. That's it. And there's no subscription. A subscription means that you have to pay monthly for it, right? Okay, no. You pay to have it activated and that's it. One time. Boom. Done. Or you can get the whole tech package if you want. I I don't, you know, the quick shifter is fun and all, but I didn't get that activated. I might eventually, but yeah. I don't know if anybody here has ever worked in a factory before, but whenever you have to retool a machine to make the same thing, but slightly different, that takes a lot of time. It takes a lot of time of that machine being down. So this is my, my opinion and why I think that's why KTM did what they did. They made everything the same. And you ought to thank them for it, for putting all this stuff on the bike and not activating it. Because one, it cuts down production cost and downtime for them. Two, it's also cheaper for the customer. Do you know how much it would cost to add cruise control? Like if they just, if they completely did not have cruise control, like this Tenere right here, it would cost around 800 bucks for me to add cruise control to the Tenere and quick shifter. If, if the uh, KTM didn't come with a quick shifter already into it, you would have to go purchase the quick shifter stuff and most of them are just quick shifter up. Nope, with KTM you got the quick shifter up and down. So yeah, it, it is a hell of a lot cheaper that KTM put the stuff on there, cheaper for the customer and not activate it because if they were to activate it you know how much you'd be paying go look up the ktm 890 um or the the 890 adventure r rally that's got everything active on it okay and that's a twenty thousand dollar 890. so yeah uh, keep complaining about having this shit um where you got you gotta dadgum have it activated it's a one-time activation process and fee yeah I don't I don't get it it is actually cheaper for KTM to build everything with it on it it's cheaper for them and it's cheaper for the customer so and it's not a subscription cow shit thank you for listening to my rant but it, it's it's to help one out you know i mean if you're looking at a ktm and you've heard somebody say oh it's a subscription it, a rent you got to oh they'll shut it off no they can't shut it off you buy it once and it's on your bike for good so yeah that's that's all it is all right well that's that's all i had to say about the uh the ktm subscription stuff